Kanye West, the renowned rapper and fashion designer, is reportedly troubled by allegations that his ex-wife, Kim Kardashian, is using their daughter North in what he perceives as manipulative relationship tactics. This development adds another layer of complexity to their already intricate post-divorce dynamics and co-parenting situation. At the heart of Kanye's concern lies the alleged involvement of their daughter, North, in the ongoing dynamics between him and Kim. According to sources close to Kanye, he believes that Kim is utilizing North as a pawn in their relationship games, a strategy that deeply troubles him. Kanye's primary worry centers around the potential impact of such actions on North. He reportedly expresses concern about the emotional and psychological effects of their daughter being caught in the middle of her parents' intricate relationship. The well-being of their daughter is said to be his utmost priority. Kim Kardashian is back at it again, resorting to questionable measures to grab the spotlight. This time, she's pulling her own daughter into the mix, all in an attempt to reconnect with her ex-husband, Kanye West. Rumor has it that Kanye is far from thrilled with Kim's sneaky tactics. For those who aren't in the know, Kim recently dropped a bombshell on their joint TikTok account. She shared a video featuring their daughter, North, both of them perfectly lip-syncing to Kanye's hit track, So Be It, while celebrating Thanksgiving. Naturally, this video caused quite a stir. At first glance, it seemed like Little North was channeling her inner Kanye. But now, people are speculating that Kim is sending some seriously mixed messages to her ex, especially given their recent divorce. Let's talk about crossing the line, shall we? Many folks believe that making videos with their daughter, dressed up as Kanye, and choosing that particular song is a clear step too far. It's becoming painfully obvious that this isn't what Kanye wants, and the public is taking notice. The drama continues. It's evident that Kim was sending a distinct message to Kanye, and if you haven't been keeping up with Kim Kardashian, you might miss it. Known for her strategic and subtle moves, Kim is seizing the opportunity to reconnect with Kanye amidst rumors of marital issues with his new wife, Bianca. However, her motives go beyond mere reconciliation. She still harbors love for him. Despite the embarrassment, Kim endures it all to prevent the couple from making more headlines. Did anyone else feel a sense of discomfort watching that video? Not referring to Northwest as she's undeniably talented in makeup artistry, but the presence of her mother just didn't sit right with me. However, I find Kim Kardashian's behavior somewhat disrespectful. For instance, let's consider their recent reunion in Dubai, which has been the talk of the town. Kim, who thrives on attention, seems to perceive this as a competition. She desires to be the center of attention and is willing to go to great lengths, even using her daughter and playing mind games with Kanye to achieve it. Kim simply cannot bear the thought of Kanye and Bianca stealing her spotlight. Thus, she resorts to creating controversy to reignite discussions about herself. Interestingly, this recurring theme continues with Kim. On a different occasion, she sang and danced to the song Ninjas in Paris by her ex-husband and Jay-Z at Pharrell Williams' Louis Vuitton show. Kim shared an Instagram story video of Jay-Z performing the hit song and later posted footage of herself rocking out to it. Adding to her captivating posts, Kim Kardashian also shared a video during a car ride featuring their youngest two children, Chicago and Psalm, rapping to true love. She shared those precious moments on her Instagram, accompanied by a captivating caption. OMG, they're just so cute, I had to share. First and foremost, let's address the children. Although these moments may appear innocent, we must acknowledge that we are discussing none other than Kim Kardashian. It's no secret that Kanye holds his children close to his heart, a fact well known to Kim. It's a low blow to exploit the kids as pawns in their ongoing drama, but given Kim's tendency to employ tactics that strike the hardest, it's not entirely surprising. It seems she's playing that card in this case. Need proof? Recall that a recent source disclosed Kanye's emotional breakdown following Kim's comments about their daughter, North. According to the source, after he saw what Kim said on the show, he broke down because he realizes how much North needs him. The source added, Hearing this from Kim about North angered Kanye and made him very upset. North is definitely a daddy's girl, and Kanye misses not seeing her every single day. This revelation adds another intriguing layer to the story, suggesting that Kim is acutely aware of the profound impact her words and actions can wield over Kanye. Skillfully leveraging this knowledge to her advantage, she strategically employs North as a means to remind Kanye of her presence. It's undeniable that Kanye would not overlook anything concerning North, and Kim astutely capitalizes on this. By doing so, she hopes to sow seeds of discord between Kanye and Bianca, ultimately leading to their separation. 
However, it is evident that the primary driving force behind these actions is jealousy. Kim harbors an intense jealousy towards the attention received by Kanye and Bianca whenever they are together. She yearns to be the focal point, willing to go to any lengths to achieve that status. Furthermore, her envy extends beyond their attention to encompass their relationship as well. In the words of Kendra Capalbo, LISW, a licensed sex and couple therapist at ESHC's retreat, as she reflected upon this situation in front of the mirror, she said, It might be difficult for Kim to see Bianca receiving the version of Kanye that she had expressed a desire to have back, a more stable version. Kim has expressed the challenges of co-parenting with him. So, in this instance, why attempt to recreate the Kimye moment? Kanye undeniably played a significant role in boosting her career, and she acknowledges that. Currently, Kim is making a concerted effort to connect with a younger audience, including TikTok users. It almost seems as though she is leveraging her daughter's presence to achieve this goal. The therapist asserted that Kim has openly recognized the difficulties and emotional struggles that marked the past few years of their relationship. Interestingly, Kim appears to feel a sense of envy towards Bianca, as she seems to be witnessing a more balanced side of Kanye, akin to the person Kim initially fell in love with. In fact, it is said that Kim dislikes hearing those close to Kanye suggest that Bianca is the best thing for him. These insights were shared by the therapist. If Kim has hints of a savior complex, which is plausible considering her past comments about being his cleanup crew throughout their relationship, it might be difficult for her to witness someone else seemingly becoming a better match for Kanye. Naturally, this outcome was expected since Kim had harbored resentment towards Bianca in the past. According to a source, Kim dislikes attractive women, and Bianca's lovely face further fueled Kim's animosity. The insider added that Kim holds a low opinion of Bianca. Interestingly, another source revealed that Kim expressed concern about the friendship between Bianca and Northwest. Kim felt threatened by their growing bond and was undoubtedly jealous. Considering Northwest's distinct personality and her prominent lineage as Kanye West's daughter, I can't help but think that Kim should allow her some space. Kim is deliberately trying to provoke both Kanye and Bianca simultaneously by involving their child, North. This tactic specifically targets Kanye's sensitivity, as Kim is well aware. In the case of Bianca, Kim calculates that her actions will indirectly affect her through Kanye's acknowledgement of North. While I wasn't exactly surprised, I must admit that Kim Kardashian has always possessed the ability to manipulate situations to her advantage. However, I draw the line when it comes to using her children. I find it inappropriate and agree with Kanye's perspective. It is unfair for Kim to exploit her kids as a means of gaining Kanye's attention, especially considering he is now married to someone else. Such behavior not only disrespects his current wife, but also places their children in an uncomfortable position. Frankly, using your children to seek attention is neither endearing nor amusing. It lacks propriety. But what are your thoughts on this? Do you think Kanye was right to call out Kim's treatment of North? Or do you think it was in poor taste? Let us know your opinion in the comments section below. We'd love to hear from you. And if you ever need to satisfy your gossip cravings or simply want to know what to anticipate from your favorite stars and movie series, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And remember, I love you guys so much and as always, I'll see you all in the next video.